Hi there, my name is Wairokisa Kwenye, Chief Executive Officer of the One Economy Foundation. The One Economy Foundation is a non-profit organization as well as a social welfare organization. As a foundation, we really see ourselves as a bridge between the dual economy. We believe that we are relevant today and will continue to be relevant because you cannot expect as a nation to, trans to achieve economic transformation without addressing social transformation. Our proudest achievement as a foundation in the last five years was establishing a robust governance framework which has really served as our guide in the foundation. And my colleagues and I are really driven in the mornings when we wake up and we come here, it's all about how can we make lives better for those in the grassroots communities. I believe it's an exciting time, um, especially in terms of technology, it's an exciting time to be alive. In my daily interactions with grassroots communities, I see great opportunities to where, tech, where we can bring technology to these communities and really bring quick solutions to their problems and make lives easier, their lives easier. And my support structure is really wide and far. Um, it comes from my parents who um, I lost at a young age but, but managed to still instill values in me that carry me till today. They've laid a very firm foundation. The guardians who stepped in afterwards, they've also played a big role in my support uh, structure. My husband who really during, especially during the last three years um, since working for the foundation has had to pick up the pieces and has had to step in as both father and mother in the house and really played a, a crucial role in helping me um, fulfill both duties. My friends who I really see as pillars in my life, the exceptional, exceptional team who really make me look good with what I do as a leader and make me look like an exceptional leader. Um, I would not have been able to achieve anything at work if it wasn't for my team. And last but not least, Mrs. Monica Gengos, First Lady of the Republic of Namibia, who has really played an integral part in shaping my career. Should I be the winner of the Namibia Businesswoman Awards? I would really hope to achieve three main things. Firstly, greater awareness. Secondly, to continue to serve as a bridge to narrow the gap between the first and second economy. And lastly, to inspire in two ways. Firstly, to inspire the first economy community on how to get involved. And secondly, to inspire second, the second economy community, my grassroots community, um, to help them believe in themselves and to highlight their potential.